In this video, we're going to look at how to move videos from one playlist to another playlist. Whether that playlist is your watch later playlist or any other one. So for instance, you go to somebody's channel, you like the collection that they have created and um, you want to watch them at a later time. But it's a lot of videos that they have put in that collection. So maybe 10, 20, you know, some people really have a lot of videos on their playlist and maybe you like all the videos there and you want to move them or you don't find the add all option which means that you would have to add all the videos to your playlist individually one after the other and it can be time consuming it can be boring and it can also discourage you from your intention so i'm going to show you an easy way to be able to add all without having to go one by one by one so i'm using my um, channel which i use for training purposes um, it's an old channel i'm just using that um, for training today so i'm just going to go into my channel which is placida Cheru. okay so let's assume that uh, you've come into my channel you like what you see you you go into my playlist you like what you see um and then you're looking through the playlist and you know we're going to use let's use um, new videos here because this has a, a few videos in it and then you come into new videos here you like you know you like the content and you would like to just move all the videos as it is to your own video but there is no add all option here, which means that you have to do this. You have to click on the three dot 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 and move to uh, save later, watch later, or click on save to playlist, which is means you have to create a new playlist. But you have to do that one by one by one by one by one. Um, and that is 16 videos. So let me show you how you know, to skip this process and to be able to move all the videos in one go. So look at the browser here. Look at the browser. I'm going to go right at the end of the browser. So I'm just moving my console to the end. And you can see that it has an, it's got F9F here, right at the end. I put my console there. I'm going to put the AND sign. Okay, so the code I want to tell you about because I've already used it before, it's already popped up. So this code, it says, and disable underscore polymer equals true. So if I hit enter, watch what's going to happen now. Voila. So now you can see that I now have the add all option. So we're going to add all this into a playlist so that you can see that it actually does add all. So I'm just going to click add all and we're going to create a new playlist. So I'm just going to do uh, Monday. Let me do testing uh, playlist. Let's call it testing playlist playlist okay so monday testing playlist uh before i click on the create what i've done is i clicked on the add all to yeah and then i didn't choose watch later but if i was going to move all the videos to watch later then i would choose what later and what i've done is i clicked on create new playlist so i have called my new playlist monday testing playlist okay just for training purposes I'm going to click the create button now. Can you see Monday testing playlist has been created. So let's see if Monday testing playlist has 16 videos. So I'm going to click on it. And you can see monday testing playlist has all the 16 videos so this is how you move videos from one playlist to another playlist 
whether it's your videos um no i think i think if it's your videos it'll be easy for you to move them because they are yours you've created them but if you go to somebody else else's channel if you go to someone else's channel and there is a playlist that's been created you like what you see you want to move the video then you can move it or you are in a collaborative program you know video program you know in a school or training wherever and there's a playlist and you need to move all the videos from that playlist to another playlist whether it's a watch later playlist or a playlist that you're going to create a new playlist like i've done then this code if you add this code to the end of the um the link it will give you the add all so when we click on the monday uh, playlist you can see it doesn't give us that option you know this is our own created playlist but it doesn't give us that option it means that you have to do the same thing add your code you know and move it now if you have created a collaborative playlist and you have invited people to add their videos to the collaborative playlist and they can't find the continue the continue side they can't find it if you add this same link that's at this same link which is the and disable underscore polymer equals true if you add this same code to the link they will be able to see the continue button and they'll be able to add their videos to the collaborative play so like i said if you are part of a collaborative playlist i just wanted to show you this screen because you know i said it and you may not understand without visualization some people need to see before they can get it so if you're part of a collaborative playlist and you don't see the continue sign which takes you to the next step add the code to the end of the url which is disable underscore polymer equals true hit enter and the continue sign would come up and then you can continue your process um, the code isn't anything it's not rocket science it's a code that is you know it's available on youtube most of youtube links have that that code but sometimes it's missing for whatever reason i don't know why it's missing you know but whenever you you're trying to have access to playlists either to move or to add videos and you you don't find the option to enable you to move videos or to add videos then add that link that code to that to the link and enter now somebody asked a question recently and the person said they had done it they had added the link and um, it, it it didn't show you know they added the link it didn't show so i told the lady i said see you know what refresh the page you know tap, click on the name of the playlist click on the name of the playlist and then add the code again and hit enter and it'll work and then she came back to me she did it and it worked for her so if you added the code and it still didn't work click on the name remember click on the name of the playlist and then add the code and hit enter and it will it will it will work or you refresh the page refresh the page add the code hit enter and it will work so thank you very much again for watching i hope you have found this video uh, valuable and it has helped you leave a comment in the comment box let me know what you think about the video if you are new to the channel you know subscribe like share um, one subscription will add to the number i'm trying to build a community it'll be amazing if this channel grows um, and i have more people viewing my videos whether it's the business training videos or my teaching videos or my training videos it would be fantastic so um, i love your support for you to um, support me by sharing my videos out or by inviting your friends to check out my channel it will be amazing so anyway thank you very much again for watching and i'll see you on my next training video bye for now and god bless